Hey there Fallout fans, this is Scott, aka The Intruder. Today I want to bring you a little tutorial on photo mode in Fallout 76. Alright, to get to photo mode, you want to pull up the map, and then down in the bottom right it'll give you that button to push for, depending upon what system you're using, photo mode, and then you push it and it brings up the photo mode. Now you've got uh, free reign of the camera to within a certain area around your character. At the top of the little photo mode box you've got uh, five little icons up on top that give you different options for each icon. For this instance this one gives you a field of view so you can make the field of view a lot wider. You can make it a lot na more narrow. Zoom in, get a little more detail. Then you got your view roll, you can uh, turn the world uh, on its side both ways. And you got your depth of field, which blurs out the background, obviously. You got the strength of your depth of field, so you can make it super, super strong. Or super, super weak. And you got your distance as to far, how far it sits behind your character. You can have it all the way up to your character. I can have to sit back farther. So you just want to bring the foreground in. And then your range, which gives you uh, control over where it starts and where it ends. The next tab is uh, whether or not we want to show the player. So if you just want to do a, a landscape view, you can turn your player off and change your player's expression. Disgusted, worry, friendly, happy, impressed, irritated. And we got our pose category, and you have your poses. We got our alt boy, pit boy, hands on hips, heroic, kneeling, ready, ready for fight. You're able to purchase these in the atomic shop. Next up is our brightness. Control how bright the screen gets. Might be helping dark, helpful in dark situations if you want a brighter saturation. You can go ahead and play with these as a contrast. Our next one is filters and textures. So we got our filters here. We, got, we can change them, turn them to whatever we want. One of my favorites is the enhance. Then we have our textures where you can add noise, color noise, and lines, aptones. And finally we have our uh, our frames. And then we got our frame categories, standard, logos, location, action, alt. So we got our standard frames, which there's not very many that come automatically, so you can get those in the, in the atomic shop. Then we got our logos and locations. Then we got our factions, raiders, responders, alt. There's your picture ID, different frames with the Now that we've established what everything does, now we can take a picture. Let's go to Enhance, and then I can change my brightness a little bit, make it a little bit brighter, and I can pose my character, my heroic pose, with a amused expression on his face. Then I can change the field of view, and I can my, reposition my camera, the shot that I want to take. Make this a little bit, uh, change it just a little bit more. Maybe come in just a little bit, and then I can toggle the toggle the box there and voila we've got a screenshot so anyways I just want to say thank you so much for watching if you haven't subscribed already hit that subscribe button give this video a thumbs up and uh, hit me up in the comment sections uh, thank you so much for watching I'll see you next time be sure to comment and leave a thumbs up 
and hit that subscribe button for more awesome content.